Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Fisoko Shlamabuza. Those that are here for the very first time, please do subscribe and hit the notification bell down below so that you get notified when I post a video. Those that are returning, thank you so much. I appreciate you guys as always. Please do make sure that your notification bell as well is on so that you get notified every time I post a video. So a couple of, okay, I don't remember when exactly, but uh, a while ago I did post on my Instagram story I'll be starting with, I'll be using the aloe vera juice on my hair. So we have an aloe vera plant. Um, so I use that as my, well, obviously you carve it and do whatever. Um, yeah, I made an aloe vera spritzer. So I've been using it for some time now. So here I'm just giving you my review basically of what has it been since I've started using the aloe vera juice on my hair so firstly what I'll do is I'll be going through the benefits that I have kept I've came across as I was reading about aloe vera juice and I'll be telling you if whether I've actually noticed such or I've actually I do I agree with such and stuff like that so yeah um I've been using aloe vera juice every single day if not every single day, but every second day. But I try by all means to just spritz the aloe vera juice on my hair um, and scalp. So I've stopped um, using water with my leave-in conditioner. So because I wanted to just focus on the aloe vera juice on its own, like itself. So yeah. Anyway, the first thing that it said about aloe vera juice is that it promotes hair growth and makes your hair to grow. Do I agree when it comes to that? <laughs> um, no, I don't. So far, my hair, I don't necessarily think it helped. It, it grew. Um, yes, it is said that our hair grows, uh, grows, sorry, my, our hair grows half an inch every month. Um, aside that, I don't necessarily think it did help my hair grow and stuff like that so no i don't agree with that and personally i don't necessarily think there are products that um, make your hair grow i do believe that there are products and things that help with stimulating growth we will talk about that in a different video so no i don't think my hair grew because of aloe vera juice and stuff like that yeah number two um it said that aloe vera juice nourishes your scalp does aloe vera juice nourishes your scalp? Well, 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 well. <laughs> well um, for me, so, <laughs> um, so for me, I don't think it nourished my scalp because, okay, by nourishing your, when it comes to nourishing your scalp, let me try and explain that in my understanding and also what I found is that aloe vera juice does help with um well aloe vera in general does help with um let's say for instance you have each scalp so it said that it helps um reduce itchiness on your scalp and then for an example there was an example that um not an example but a scenario that i also found that aloe vera juice is really helpful when it comes to let's take someone um burnt themselves so it does help with that um and stuff like that but did it help me? Because I'm someone who's really prone to, not prone, but I'm someone who really, um, what's this thing? I'm someone who's really, who really has an itchy scalp. My scalp is really itchy, uh, gets really itchy and stuff like that. Um, but it's, uh, no, um, I love it. <laughs> Aloe vera juice it did not help me when it comes to reducing um, the irritation like on my scalp. I felt like at some point it actually made my hair itch more, like my scalp itch more. So I started not necessarily putting the aloe vera, like spraying the juice on my scalp. So, but obviously remember we are different. But for me, when it comes to um, nourishing my scalp no i felt like aloe vera juice made my scalp itch even more than it normally does so i stopped um after using it i think for two weeks because i actually noticed with no man i feel like my scalp is itching like it's really itchy like more than before so i stopped um spraying it on like directly on my scalp i ended up spraying it 
on my hair focusing on my hair because no one wants an itchy scalp on it so aloe vera juice is safe that it also reduces dandruff but unfortunately i can't necessarily talk much with regards to that but because like i said i stopped using aloe vera juice after two weeks on my scalp i stopped spraying aloe vera juice on my scalp but i did notice that so i have my scalp i have really dry scalp so regardless of my scalp itching like itching for that two weeks um it did not flake as much as it da Ugh. it didn't flake that much <laughs> that's what i'm trying to say but i feel like two weeks is not enough to actually come with a review and observe at that so that's why I initially i said i don't wanna i don't have much to say with regards to um dandruff another thing um that they say aloe vera helps with is moisturizing your hair and i must agree with this it does it really 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 yeah <laughs> but it does really okay that was dramatic but it does really moisturize your hair for me it does it did moisturize my hair my hair so normally like for instance what i used to do is that after I, i'd wash my hair i'd um for my l for my L, you know L is liquid or leave-in conditioner. So I wouldn't um, put a leave-in conditioner. Sometimes I would because <laughs> it's cold. You need a lot of moisture. But I'd always spray as my, yes, my hair is damp. But I'd also spray like the aloe vera juice on my hair before my, like on my hair and then do the rest of ELCO. So what I've noticed is that my hair before I used um, aloe vera juice on that method, my hair would um, dry really quickly. Like my hair would, I'd need to moisturize my hair during the week. Um, as my hair, like I think a day or two after, like after doing my LCO because of how my hair would like get dry is like pretty, ugh. my hair would get dry pretty soon because of how cold it is. But since I've started using, um, the apple oh sorry since i've started using the aloe vera juice i've noticed that my hair um what's i don't know how to explain it but my hair would just be moisturized for a long period than it normally is or that it was since the winter like since winter started so yeah i agree fully 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 when it comes to moisturizing your hair so it's said that aloe vera juice also makes your hair soft <laughs> well if you are someone who i feel like today i'm really dramatic but anyway if you are someone who is um who takes care of their hair and whatnot your hair will be soft if you are looking after it so does aloe vera juice make your hair soft i would say it does but because for me for me um and why am i saying it does because I do take care of my hair. My hair is soft. So I wouldn't say there will be much difference when it comes to um, making my hair soft. But because it did not make my hair hard, so I don't think it's fair to say no. So it's best to just say it does make your hair soft because it did not make my hair rough or hoff or whatever you want to call it. So, yeah. I hope I am making sense though. But, <laughs> yeah. And then aloe vera juice is also said to make your hair shiny. And yes, 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 yes. It does make your hair shiny. I've noticed that my hair, um, I don't really think my hair is black. And I also don't think my hair is brown. But whatever color my hair is, is more bold. And it's more, yeah, shiny. And But not all sheen shiny. You know when you spray all sheen and your hair is like shiny no not all sheen shiny but the color of your hair does really pop um the color of my hair is popping and the color of my hair does pop um so yeah that's what i've also noticed when it comes to aloe vera juice would i continue with using aloe vera juice i would actually speak uh, honestly speaking i would i would i would because of why would i continue I think it's, it's because of how it makes, like how it moisturizes my hair. That's why I, I'd continue with using aloe vera juice. It's how it moisturizes my hair. 
but I think I'll only use it for the duration of like the winter season because I need my hair to be moisturized. I need a lot of moisture. Everyone needs moisture when it comes to the winter holiday and in general, but you know how winter is. I can't keep on emphasizing that but yeah i think that's the only reason why i'd continue using aloe vera on my hair because of how it moisturizes my hair it's really amazing when it comes to moisture i'm not gonna lie when it comes to moisture it's amazing the only thing that i'd say i reacted badly is the itchiness but yeah i hope this video was helpful i hope you enjoyed it as well please do subscribe and hit the notification bell and share this video and thank you thank you so much for watching till yeah i hope i'll see you in my next video